Hello there, hope all of you are doing well. I'm Akilesh, and I'll be your guide during this video. Let's study about Our Lady of Sorrows today. When it comes to life's sufferings, Mary, the mother of Jesus, is referred to by many names. Our Lady of Sufferings, Our Lady of Dolors, the Sorrowful Mother or Mother of Sorrows, and Our Lady of Piety, Our Lady of the Seven Sorrows, Our Lady of the Seven Dolors. A common religious concern and a Catholic devotion is Mary's Seven Sorrows. The Christian iconography depicts the Virgin Mary as tearful and mournful, with one or seven swords piercing her heart, alluding to Simeon's prophecy found in Luke 2 verses 34 and 35. The Chaplet of the Seven Sorrows, the Seven Principal Dolors of the Blessed Virgin, the Novena in honor of the Seven Sorrows of Mary, and the Via Matris are examples of religious activities related to this title. Every September 15, the Feast of Our Lady of Sorrows is recognized liturgically, in many Catholic nations, however, a feast known as the Friday of Sorrows is observed. It is important to distinguish between the five sorrowful mysteries of the Rosary and these seven sorrows. According to tradition, the seven sorrows are 1. The Prophecy of Simeon in Luke 2 2. The Flight into Egypt in Matthew 2 3 the loss of the child Jesus in the Temple of Jerusalem, also in Luke 2. 4. Mary meeting Jesus on the Via Dolorosa, the fourth station of the cross which is not found in the Bible. 5. The crucifixion of Jesus on Mount Calvary in Matthew 27, Mark 15, Luke 23, and especially John 19. 6. Jesus' descent from the cross in Matthew 27, Mark 15, Luke 23 and John 19. 7. The burial of Jesus by Joseph of Arimathea also in Matthew 27, Mark 15, Luke 23. 